Hi, I'm Patty Nelson. I'm an academic educator as well as a clinical educator, and I've been doing uh, some type of education for about 18 years now. Uh, I grew up. I grew up learning from a group of collaborative colleagues, both from Europe and from the U.S., who believed very strongly in differential diagnosis and pathomechanics and biomechanics. And from that training, I recognized how much better I could be in the clinic at diagnosing things if I really understood anatomy and could locate structure specifically, kind of the fundamentals of physical therapy practice. And that led me to teach my colleagues because I was finding I was having success and I was kind of passionate about it. So I would uh, share that with, with my colleagues who were interested and, and I found that to be really, um, you know, kind of uplifting and it became a passion of mine. And that sent, sent me off to go and get my advanced uh, doctoral degree and to take a job in academia. It's when I took the job in academia that I realized I needed more resources because uh, there wasn't a textbook um, of the things that I had studied. I had to draw my own. I had to use a legal size sheet and write like mad to take all those notes. Uh, so I did that to my students too. I would draw on someone and they would take pictures, someone else would be madly drawing. Uh, we would combine our efforts then, put that together and that became the lab handout over several years, a few editing. It was kind of rough, but it was better than nothing. You know, sometimes the first time you learn things, it's just a lot. And, and so these videos became a resource for them as they were initially learning, but more importantly, as they were going back. Um, and even in the clinic, I've had a few students say, gosh, I wish I had access uh, to some of that resource material that we saw in, in the classroom. Uh, because there's times where I have to do something I haven't done in a while. And, and being able to recall it is not something that I have time to go look for in the book. I definitely have found the process to be a good learning experience. There's nothing like having to draw, um, draw anatomy to know, know that you know it. In fact, I worked in a, in a chronic pain clinic uh, for three or four years. Um, and these pain, interventional pain physicians um, would put the needle where I marked the needle to go. So that was a kind of a refining ground for me um, prior to my, my stepping into academia.